the worst thing the narcissist can imagine. You always felt like something was not right with the narcissist. They were always behaving in a strange way. They did things that you didn't expect them to do. And you may have assumed that it was the result of some childhood trauma. You may have assumed that maybe they went through something when they were younger. So you stuck with them. You tried to help them. You tried to make them feel more comfortable. But then you later discovered just how evil they really are. You discovered that they know exactly what they are doing. It's determined beforehand. They're doing it deliberately and intentionally. They're intentionally hurting you. They're intentionally sabotaging the relationship. Because although they may love the benefits and conveniences that you're providing to them, they hate you because you're able to provide it to them. They hate your qualities and abilities. They're very envious and jealous. They're emotionally unstable. Which causes them to suddenly become very angry and upset. It results in unpredictable behavior where you never know what they're going to do next. Which is why you cannot depend or rely on them. You cannot trust them because you never know what they're going to do. They're unpredictable. Anything could set them off. Anything could cause them to change how they feel about you. They could love you one minute and hate you the next. With no rhyme or reason, with no logical explanation or good sense. But at some point, you do start to make sense of it. You start to figure out who they are and that's when they begin to step up their game. They become even more manipulative. They become even more calculating. They will lie to you. They will future fake. They will promise something about a possible future in order to get what they want in the present. And what they want is for you to accept them. And for you to not desire them to change. And they do that by making you believe that things are going to be different in the future. If you wait and stay patient with them. And many of you do wait because you want to believe that things can get better. You want to believe that there's something greater in the future. So you wait for months or even years in some cases because you're expecting it to come into fruition. But then one day, they ghost you, they disappear, they cut contact with you, and then you realize it was all a setup. They tricked you, they deceived you, and then it becomes clear to you that you were dealing with a narcissist, even though they may be lying to you, even though they may be denying it. Because you gave everything you had and you got nothing back in return. So no matter how much they try to get you to trick your mind into thinking it's something else. The evidence is staring at you in the face. It's a done deal. And you might choose to confront them. You might tell them that they're a narcissist. But that's not going to solve anything. It's just going to trigger them. It's just going to make them mad. And then they're going to want revenge. They're going to want to punish you. Because they know what a narcissist is. 
and they know that it's exactly what they've done to you. They know they've tricked you. They know they've robbed you and left you with nothing. They may act crazy, but they're not that far detached from reality. They are aware of these things, which is why when you confront them, it will trigger them. It will make them mad because they know that what you're saying is true. They already know what they are. They already know what they've done to you. They just don't want to accept it. They want to push it away and act like nothing's happening. But they know the truth of what they are. That's why they do everything they can to hide it. But they're quite comfortable discarding you once you've figured them out. Because by that time they've already used you up. They've already robbed you of everything that you had to offer. But what if they weren't able to do that? What if you got rid of them before they had the chance to take everything you have? That would be the narcissist's worst nightmare. That would be the worst thing that they can imagine. They can't imagine anything worse than that. Because they know you figured them out. They know you're never going to see them in the same way ever again. So what hope do they have of coming back? The narcissist knows when you're onto them. They know when you figure them out. They're very sensitive to certain changes in the environment. They know when you see them differently. They will even start an argument just to see how you react because it tells them where you are in the mind. It tells them what you're thinking and what you're planning to do. But if you don't react and you manage to get away without suffering any punishment or injury, it destroys them. It's the worst thing they can imagine because you've ruined their plans for you. They didn't finish using you up. They didn't get revenge. Because you disappeared secretly and unexpectedly before they had the chance to do that. And that's really the best thing you can do in these situations because nothing good is going to come out of confronting them or exposing them. That's not going to make them change. The only thing you can do is leave without letting them know what you're planning to do because it will only make them mad. It will only make them turn against you and then they will try to beat you to the punch. They will try to get you before you get them. They will try to destroy your life as much as they can before you get the chance to leave because they know what you're about to do if you've already warned them that you're planning to leave which is why you have to move in stealth mode where they're unable to detect your moves because they're very unpredictable you never know what they're going to do to you but whatever it is it's going to make it difficult for you to move on and live a happy and fulfilling life that is free from abuse. Because they can't deal with the thought of you moving on and being happy. That's the narcissist's worst nightmare. They can't imagine anything worse than not being able to affect you. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, 
my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching at narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.